A Gold Coast theme park has apologised for its treatment of a Paralympic gold medalist who was banned from its rides. But Movie World is not backing down, saying the move was justified by its strict safety policy. Tracy Barrell has done it all. Missing three limbs since birth, the mother of two won two gold medals at the Barcelona Paralympics. The Order of Australia recipient surfs, rides horses and drives a car. But when she tried to go on a kids ride at Movie World, she was told not a chance. I feel discriminated against and, it's, and this is the sneakiest type of discrimination. Tracy bought three VIP passes to enjoy Warner Village theme parks with her boys. She claims at no time was she told of their policy regarding disabled people using the rides, which is assessed on a person-to-person -person basis. Nobody said anything at booth 11 when I had my photo taken. No one said anything at the wheelchair turnstile. She wanted to go on the Road Runner rocket ride, which the theme park itself describes as fast, fun and safe. Instead, she was escorted to guest services and told all rides were off limits. I'm just sort of following this random lady who's dragging me off away from my children and the rides because I've got to go explain myself for some reason. Movie World insists it was the right decision, but offered an apology. As safety is of paramount importance, I think we got it right in that circumstance. What we are very sorry for is if she felt humiliated in any way as a result of that. Warner Village theme parks say they changed their policy after the death of an American amputee on a roller coaster some months ago. It applies to all of their theme parks, including SeaWorld and Wet n Wild. The theme park refunded half the cost of the VIP pass so she could still accompany her children. On the Gold Coast, Simon Hooper, 10 News.